I am here on the grounds of NCI, and we're going to be inter. <laughs> I am here on the grounds of NCI, and we're going to be interviewing college students to see their advice on how we can get through college in one piece. Let's go. I am joined today with Case, Jenna. State your name and occupation. Angela, and I'm a student. Angela, and she's a student. Joe. What's up, Joe? How are you? I'm all good. Yourself, Joe? I am chilling, bro. Chilean Andrade. AKA the anti yourself. And <laughs> hi, Kate and Jenna. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. What are you guys studying? I'm studying marketing. Marketing as well. Psychology. Why are you studying psychology? Um, I have an interest in the human mind and behavior. I'm studying business. I'm in final year. Okay. Okay. Final year student. Why do both of you study in marketing? Do you like it? We love it. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. What are you studying, Julian? I'm studying business. Why are you studying business? I have no clue. Yeah. Okay. What year are you in? Final year. She's in her final year, guys. You better pray for Angela. Now tell me, what is it like studying business in your final year? You know, it's not as hard as I thought it was, you know. Um, I have the right mindset for the year, mm -hmm. you know. And obviously all my XP from all the three years in college has helped me, so yeah, you know. Uh, it's too easy? That's too easy. It's too, it's, too it's, easy. it's too easy. For me anyways, man, some people don't do it like me, so you know, what can I say? Do you like, do you like business? Yeah. Okay, so if you could rewind time and choose something else, what would you choose? Like, different cars? Yeah. Business. I'm joined today with a pretty boy himself. Jamra. Jamra, how are you? I'm all good, how are you two? I'm chilling. What, what are you studying? Computer science. Okay, tell me what that's like. Uh, kind of struggling right now. I failed an assignment my first semester, even though I cheated. That's how you know it's hard. Uh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Why are you studying HR? No, it's good to deal with people. I um, find it quite interesting. It's rather better than going into a business, which is quite general. So. Why are you studying computing? Because uh, it makes money. Is that the only reason why yeah. you're studying? <laughs> it, it makes money, you know? Some people just do a degree for the money. I, and I hear that. I hear that. Why did you choose computer science? Because it's just the way the world's going. Like, you know, ev like everyone's glued to their phones every day. So I might as well make some money out of it. Okay. And if you had a second choice, would you still choose computer science? No. Why? Because it's what my head wants, but it's not what my heart wants. Oh, oh, quote, 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 quote. Mm, 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 mm. Accounting and finance. You study accounting and finance? Yeah. Okay, tell me what that's like. So, I won't lie, it's kind of difficult this year. Obviously, it's first year, so you got numerous modules, and obviously the first semester and the second semester. So, so far, it's been a bit difficult, but I'm handling well. Why on earth did you choose business? Um, so, I already have like a beauty degree, so I wanted to like get the business mindset behind it for the future, so the idea would be to combine both of the careers. Um, so that's why I decided to do it. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm chilling, what are you studying? Masters in finance. Masters in finance. Now if you could rewind time and choose something else, what would you choose or would you still choose finance? I wouldn't choose finance. You wouldn't, why, why not? <laughs> I don't like the syllabus maybe and it's not fun to study finance. I feel marketing is way better than finance. Psychology. 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 Why are you studying psychology? Um, I always found human behavior quite interesting. Why not? <laughs> That's it. If you could, let's say, rewind time and then choose a course again, would you still choose business? Uh, yeah. Okay, why? Because it has the lowest points. But do you like it though? Like, is it appealing? Yeah. You no, know, yeah, I do. I've, business was my H1 subject in secondary school, so. Okay. Okay. Smart guy, smart guy. No, you just, just look at me, look okay. at me. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, Ima, you used to be studying. What did you used to study before? I So I have to technically two degrees. So before I started in NCI, I did an apprenticeship in insurance brokers. So I have my level eight in insurance practice. And then I did business in NCI. Okay. Staying on, staying on the business subject, why did you choose business? Uh, I don't know. It was always I was really good at it in school. It was always something that like I enjoyed, and I was like, you know, I can kind of broaden out into anything. I could go marketing, I could go accounting, anything like that. So I was just like, yeah, business is the way forward. Hey, it's WAE Dave. Don't forget to like and subscribe and to share this video. So tell me, Evan, was there anything you were expecting when you were coming into college? Uh, I wasn't expecting to have the level of freedom that we do. When you were coming into college, were you coming expecting okay, college is going to be like this, and then as soon as you went, as soon as you entered the doors, you're like, oh. It's actually like this instead. I won't lie, when I was coming to college, I wasn't expecting it to be like this at all. Like I was expecting it to be, I don't know, a lot more difficult. And don't get me wrong, it is difficult, but 
like like the enjoyment and everything that comes with it. I wasn't expecting it to be this enjoyable, if that makes sense. Um, I was expecting a lot of partying and not much work. And what's it like now? A lot of work and not much partying. <laughs> I heard that. Uh, the SU. I was expecting not that many horny people. But every time I come to the SU, I see boys and girls doing stuff. And I know you can quote me on that. I can quote me on that. No word of a lie. What year are you in, actually? First year. All right. So when you got into college, was there something that you were expecting, but you saw the reality and you're like, eh, eh? No, like, you can't really expect much out of computing. Like, it's a nerdy course. So, like, I just had low expectations for it, to be honest. Everyone bigs it up, like, oh, you go to college and you go out this night and you go mad this day and yeah. no one goes to lectures and all that. And then you get about three weeks in and you go, oh. Uh, Lovely. This is actually just going to class. It's like a different type of school. Okay. What's your favorite part about college? <laughs> well, just chilling, like getting involved in things outside of just actually doing work. Um, football, as you said earlier, like the African society, just getting involved with people and doing activities. <laughs> We're just going to start like this. <laughs> Based on all of your experience in college and everything that you've seen in the SU, because you've probably seen a lot. Based on everything... What advice would you give to anybody that is coming to college? Jo the best thing to do is be yourself. Like, there is something for everyone. Get involved as much as you can. Join every club and society. If you don't like it, just don't go again. Talk to people. Put yourself out of your comfort zone. Attend your fucking <laughs> classes, because if you don't, you'll be f <laughs> Word! Maybe to not, like, jump into it straight away, because when I finished, I felt like I wouldn't be prepared to go right in. Um, and especially to do with like points and courses and like competing for like places um, like I thought about it for a while and I went to do something different and then I feel like them years like I kind of matured a bit before I went and like I kind of looked into it as well but I feel like if I had jumped into something straight away I probably would have picked a course that wasn't really suited for me um, but I'd probably say that if you want to do it like go for it but just make sure that you are picking something that you're interested in. Perfect. Wise words from a wise woman. We love to see it. What's your advice to get through college? Lots and lots of Red Bull. This is the advice right here. They're plugging the Red Bull. <laughs> you know, we love to see it. I'd say like to be prepared because I tend to leave things super last minute anyways. And I wish I had known in advance. No, no, they did let us know in advance, but I left things super last minute. So do all the reading, do all your work, do all your assignments on time. As soon as the lecturer gives you an assignment, start it. So you're not piled, it doesn't pile up like how we are right now and you feel stressed. So yeah, just do all your work. Honestly, focus on your academics. Like all these, the boy, the husband that you're looking for, you're not going to find in college. I can't lie to you. <laughs> you're not going to find it. The girlfriend you're looking for, you're not going to find it. Focus on your degree because your future is far more important than, you know, you know. Mm, mm, mm. Focus on your degree. No husband, no love island. Don't do drugs, don't do weed, don't go to class. Hi. Been there, done that. It's not nice. <laughs> well, there you have it. Business is very broad, so, you know, try and take in what you can and then from there learn, you know, uh, what you want to specify in and all of that, you know. And, you know, you, you still have time throughout the three years, so, you know, get a taste of everything you like. And then you get me. Make sure you're on top of all your work. That's it. Because a lot of people take that for granted. Study. And don't try cheat because you'll fail like me. <sighs> Quote. Done. I just say, like, just come and be yourself. Like, be free. Don't feel like you have to come in and be a certain way, act a certain way. Like, come in, show your personality, show who you are. And people, obviously, there'll be people who don't like you. That's how life is. But there's going to be people who like you and they'll like your vibe. Do you get me? So I just say, just be yourself and enjoy yourself throughout the whole experience. Mix with people as soon as possible. Talk to everyone. Don't be scared to go up to people. Because most of the people are the exact same thing. Like, they're walking in don't know anyone they're coming from all different areas like i you know you come from skildare is it tala Ta same thing <laughs> comes from tala like i'm coming from north side so completely different and yeah it's best to just mix perfect put yourself out there because you learn so much about yourself in college and you grow so much as a person so the thing i would suggest mainly is just be yourself and like that don't be worried about rejection or anything like that tell me david what advice would you give to anybody that is coming to study hr to be honest, I feel like it's important to look through your course. Some people go straight into college without actually looking into detail what they can actually get from the course. Just educate yourself a bit more. 
And apart from that, don't just do a course because people are telling you or peer pressuring you to do a course because at the end of the day, you will end up dropping out. I'm in final year now and I've seen people that have done first, second and third year and have already dropped out because they realized the course wasn't for them. It was inf they were influenced by other people's decisions. That's what I would say. End of the day, don't do your course because your parents told you to do your course. Do it for yourself. And that's the end of the video. Bye. Thank you very much. Love, peace, and God bless. Thanks, thank you. Thank